we'll add is a new feature that makes data handling and API interaction much easier. Integrating AI agent into your data pipeline can be super cool, but in most cases, you want your AI agent to generate structured data formats, especially when we're dealing with relational database, because we all know relational database is always strict with data formats, and we want to make sure our data is 100% formatted and accurate. In DeFi, when we used to make sure the output of our nodes is pure JSON type, we had to set up a parameter extractor and then prompting and validating this parameter extractor many, many times. Or we will have to use this code node and type into a bunch of Python. But even with all this effort, if you're trying to fetch the JSON type data in subsequent nodes, you will see the JSON type data can only be transmitted as string. But now no more prompting and coding because structured output is native in DeFi. If we go to our node, you will see in the output variable, we added a structured switch. And under the output variable, if we toggle it on, you will see the structured output object. And if we click on configure, you will see this beautiful structured output schema editor. So now let's dive into how to use this editor. So here, as an example, I'm going to build a data pipeline that will transform this customer intake form into JSON type data and post that JSON into our database. Our database requires specifically this JSON format. And what we can do here is we can just paste that JSON format into our editor here. And now we have this beautiful schema. We can actually add it on top of this using the visual editor. So here, I don't want the phone number to be mandatory. I can just turn off this required. You can predefine the data type for each field as string, number, object, and array. If the data type is object, you can add child field under this object. For example, the contact information has two child fields, which are email and phone number. And you can actually add description for each field to tell LLM what exactly this field is for and prompt LLM how to extract this data. We can click here to inspect the whole JSON schema, and we can click on the star button to let AI write JSON schema for us, and you can choose whichever model you like in here. If you may notice, when we're done configuring, there will be a yellow exclamation. That's because the model we currently use doesn't natively support structured output. If we are using API to call models like GPT-4 Mini, it will use OpenAI's native structure output configuration. And this configuration can help us 100% get the structure output as we want. And the yellow exclamation will just disappear. If we're using models that doesn't necessarily support structure output like Cloud 3.5, what actually happens is it will pass that JSON schema as a prompt and hopefully it will return the JSON schema as we want. To use the structure output object in subsequent node, for example, we're using an HTTP request to post that data into our database. For the request body, we can choose JSON and we can hit slash here and choose the structure output object that our LLM generated. And the best part is you can actually see DeFi recognizes all the fields within our JSON tab data. We have customer object, name, company name, and contact info. So you can choose to access to any specific field as you want. Let's try our custom intake form, which we have customer name, Michael Scott, company name, Dunder Mifflin, and blah, 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 and click on start to run. You will see the request success, and in the response body, we get at the customer information is well received. And if we actually check it on my Postman mock server, you can see our request body is well formatted. So we just built a simple but well formatted data pipeline in minutes. Go try this new feature on yours.